Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. I am the Casual Brit and welcome back to the Music Rally series. So we're going to go through all of the settings again because I did not save from the previous race. So in this one we are doing Tokyo Expressway Central Clockwise. We have the music of room that we have to drive to. So I did notice that I didn't explain the braking indicator in the last episode. So I'm going to do that quickly now as we get ready to start the race. So the braking indicator, it has no effect on the car as such. It's just a visual aid. If I am, um, for example, not very good at a track or have not raced a track for a very long time, it is kind of a last minute save as I go past a braking zone, for example. So it has no effect on the actual performance of the car. It's just a extra little cushion for myself. So with that all said and done, let's get into this race. We have a bronze time of 3.92 miles. We have a silver time of 4.85 miles. And then we have a gold time, which of course is the objective today of 5.22 miles. We're going to see if we can get that done today. So this car handles a little bit different from the Porsche. We are of course driving a Honda. As we take a little quick peek inside the car, look at that interior looking absolutely beautiful in Gran Turismo 7. So yeah, this car handles a little bit different. It has a smaller wheelbase, so the tyres are a lot thinner. Which means you have to be extra careful on the brakes and the accelerator as you're going to see here we just when we're when we're applying the brakes we have to really feather the brakes and the throttle as we're coming out of these turns or into these turns in case of the brakes now for you eagle-eyed viewers out there you may notice that i have already set a benchmark of 5.2 miles now this is my second attempt because as you saw in the intro the, the settings were not saved, so I was actually back on to the man or the automatic transmission. So I did lose definitely a lot of time there as we get all squirrely coming out of this corner. I'm gonna fly past the golf here. So yeah, we did lose quite a lot of time on that, that first attempt. We're gonna try and do better here on the second as we start the second lap here. Go through a little bit of a track guide. These first two corners are in in the case of this Honda completely flat. We're gonna have a little bit of lift here as we have a Mazda in the way, so we couldn't really take the optimal line. But this one should be definitely flat as the fair lady is quite a good way ahead. We're gonna come through the tunnel here on the second lap. Keeping it tight into the walls, onto the apexes of these S bends. They're not really corners, they're just kind of bendy. We're going to go up the hill here. Now coming up to the top of the hill here. We're just going to have a cheeky little lift again because we have a little bit of traffic. I do think you can take that corner flat as well. This car does not have a lot of power. So you should be able to get away with just a little lift or just completely flat. Now we're coming into this corner, you're going to definitely want to lift off early and then gently apply the power as you start to drift through the corner. Again the same for this one, we're going to take an early lift, apply the throttle as slowly as needed, building all the way up to 100% again. We did have a little bit of a lift there as we were coming past the Mini. This corner is going to be completely flat here, coming through the tunnel. However, this corner up here, we're going to go for a very big lift. We actually go into the wall here, so I should have probably hit the brake there. But it's not going to matter, we are going to beat our gold time. Coming home with a 5.26, probably could have been a lot better. This is not going to be a guide into the best possible laps in the world. 
this is just a basic complete guide how to get the gold medal so we've got the gold medal for this one but that is going to do it for this video thank you so much for watching let me know down in the comments if this guide has helped you and also let me know your personal best i would love to hear from you but that's it for me until next time take care and goodbye